Hello everyone, you're watching PokerNews.com and I am in the midst of probably one of the best sandwiches I've ever had and I feel sorry panini. for them because of the delicious panini. I just did eat a lot of garlic so my apologies in advance but we're gonna get right into this now. You guys just arrived. I know it was a super long journey. There was snow, there was difficulties with luggage. It's never easy to get halfway around the world. Correct. But you are here and willing to do an interview which is important. Immediately though, coming here and jumping right out of real reality and into virtual reality, you just tried the virtual reality game and I know that you're not a novice to this. I've seen some images of you before. Tell me, tell me about your experience in this virtual reality world. Um, so the game they have here is Space Pirate Trainer, which is in my top three of all virtual reality games to play. You get to be, well, as it would sound, a space pirate. But actually, I'm not sure if you're the pirate or you're defending against pirates, but either way, there's these like drone things that come at you in waves and you get to like fully Rambo it up with two guns in your hand. And if you, you know, feeling particularly active, you can duck and roll, you have to dodge gunfire. It's amazing and it's all about getting the high score. And I'm just going to throw out there in terms of being a space pirate that uh, it looks like you may or may not have been in space recently with a camel. I don't even know what's going on. Is there, are you on one of these like trips to the moon? You know, things happen. I, uh, no, no explanations are possible. For this check, out the, check out the Twitter is all I'm saying. It's a, be it's a beautiful picture. Now, there are aliens out there. We know that much. I, I mean, I believe that. If you don't, it's a little, a little odd. These might be aliens too. I'm also not sure. But you know, you're you're plus you're plus EV. You're you might be like one of the best poker players in the world. But apparently, you're not quite as good at virtual reality as Liv, and also maybe not as good at hide and seek. So can I understand like where is hide and seek something that you guys do regularly? Is this something that you're working on the meta game so you can maybe find next time? Um, well, for virtual reality, she she's putting in the time, you know, she's grinding it out. It's uh, she's very Training. aware of the future, I guess. And that's definitely where we were going to spend in more time later with the more, camel more. Yeah. And for hide and seek, um, she has the the right structure, I think. Like it, it really helps to be the size and like movability that you have to like get, and especially like the creativity, like the places she goes into. The first time, not the first time, but like in the fourth time that like she hid somewhere was me looking through the whole room, which is pretty small room. Like you're kind of like look through we're everything in, in three hotel. minutes. We're in a hotel room. Okay, yeah. So we're so maybe 500 yeah. square feet at most. Yeah, and. Uh, just look through it two or three times, no place to be okay. And then you start going crazy because you're like, okay, I know the person is in there. And you look I'm like everywhere. Yeah, like what, what What? happened? Oh, she probably didn't exist in the first place. I just woke up. <laughs> I just woke up. It's My a video game. My friends were so nice. They were like the whole time, Wait, like while seeing you hanging out with someone, Wait, just, just like <laughs> playing along. Such I good friends. It's not real. It's not real. Anyway, she hid we're in having the, inception. She hid in the suitcase of my luggage and I just who looks there who hides there anyway it was great but she has managed to like surprise me every single time now and now again um, with new spots to be in and the one I saw I, immediately I thought how a did you even get up there and then quietly and then like very this was like above like a washer dryer situation I have one of those in my apartment I can barely fit the detergent up above there so is this is this a game you've been working on or is this just something that's kind of it's just natural to your shape size and, and intelligence level I mean let's just say if super high rollers were hide and seek I would win them all I would be the federal holtz of of hide and seek. Ship it. She would be. And in the future, in this video game where she exists with a camel in space, uh, I feel like hide and seek might be the next 100k super high roller. Either way, I appreciate you guys taking the time. Oh my God, I know you're gonna you hide just in got VR here. next time, right? Yes. You're just gonna hide into the reality. <laughs> She's oh. gonna hide in another dimension, and we're gonna go there too. No. Forget it, guys. Where you're gonna need the CERN collider to find her again, the Hadron Collider. You guys are watching PokerNews.com.